Adam Joke Vlog. In celebration of the Toronto Raptors winning the NBA Finals with their star adorned in New Balance instead of Nike's Jordan brand, I decided to pick up New Balance's latest flagship shoe, the 990 version 5. Now I'm no slouch to the 99X series from New Balance. Been wearing them since 2005. First starting out with the 991, 992, 993, then 990 version 3. The last I had had, I skipped over version 4. Anyways, my old shoes I've had since 2013 and they've been my everyday workhorse shoe. Not necessarily a running shoe, though this shoe was originally designed for running. Some other technologies have since surpassed it in that field. It's a heavier workhorse day shoe. And if you got this on your feet, you're going to be comfortable. Made proudly in the USA, the only premium flagship shoe I know of that is actually made here. Okay, by here I mean Boston. Some folks call it a dad shoe, I call it a grown-ass man shoe. Classic gray, just about everything with white laces. There is no carbon fiber underneath, whereas the old version does have that. I think they got rid of that with version 4 though. Wondering if they're going a little cheaper on materials, it doesn't really look that way. Everything's thickly padded. I'm hoping that there's going to be less of these outside dressing pieces going green with age as these shoes tend to do. For comparison, you can see that on my version 3, that outside wall is much thinner than on the version 5, providing a very snug fit, but these are available in narrow and wide foot sizes. Among other new features, there's a semi-translucent support strap on the side. This should be similar to Adidas's cage on the Ultra Boost. The 990 version 5 mixes a classic silhouette with some edgier, futuristic, design elements, but overall cleaner than the previous models, with larger spaces of mesh less broken up by leather straps. Definitely a cleaner design than the outgoing shoe. Padding continues across the tongue, very thick tongue, which so far seems to stay in place better than previous models. Now what say you I go ahead and lace these up and give you an on foot view? Ah yes, the on foot shot. This is what YouTube seems to crave, weird foot fetish shit. You know, all these sneaker heads, they get you with the EDM music. Oh hey, we got on feet, here's shots of that. The New Balance 990 version five is by no means a hot shoe that you're gonna have to pay markup on eBay. But if you're looking for an adult casual shoe, that you can wear possibly at work, give it a go. Okay, so you've made it this far, but are you ready to go further? Are you ready to hit the subscribe button, ring the bell, and maybe even sign up for my weekly podcast on Patreon? It's only one buck a month.